Primers and probes are designed using Primer Blast technology to amplify two regions of the mitochondrial genome. One set of primers and probes are far apart, and therefore only amplifying molecules containing the common deletion. The second set amplifying all molecules, specifically a region containing no known deletions. Zooming out to the rest of the cell, we see that this constant control region acts as an internal control to account for a varying number of mitochondrial DNA molecules in every cell. The reaction takes place. The constant control region is amplified in all molecules, while the deleted region is only amplified in those containing the common deletion. The real-time PCR machine can then detect levels of fluorescence emitted by the fluorogenic probes. Data is then presented as a percentage of the control.